It's been a great weekend here in Sarasota. We were welcomed by the Sarasota Sailing Squadron and the Bazelli Multi-Hull Rendezvous. We brought together the largest group of Windrider owners in the history of the company. We're really a family and we would welcome you to become part of the Windrider family. It was amazing how many different Windriders came together from all over the country. Oh, it's just been, it's been so exciting just to have uh, so many people show up that really love these boats and the camaraderie and the, we've gotten to look at each other's boats and figure out how to do this and, and having Jim Brown here has just been a real treat. Well, I've always been a, a trimaran man, you know. I've, I've always thought that the multi-hull configuration was best as the, the so-called double outrigger canoe, a main hull and two floats. The essential difference in the Windrider is the, is the ergonomics of operating the thing. You sit down in the, in the cockpit, instead of squatting on a trampoline, you're down in the boat and you're actually captured up to your ribs by the cockpit opening, such as in a kayak. The real difference is that one steers these boats with the feet. You have foot pedals inside. Your feet are down inside the boat like in a kayak with your, your foot pedals at hand. And that means that if you're steering with your feet, unlike in most sailboats, you have both hands free. And that gives you the opportunity to operate the lines, the, the sheets as we call them, these ropes that come in from the jib and from the mainsail. You can be much more of an instrumentalist in playing the boat, you know, because you have both hands free. Well, when people come on our boat, first, they're initially they're a little bit nervous because they're about any sailboat, but once they're on there, they're so relaxed because it's so stable and uh, it's, they can't believe how it's kind of exhilarating the, even at a few knots, like you get to 10 or 15 knots and it's a lot of fun. My husband's got some seats on there and we just sit back and relax. Sometimes we pick up people around the lake and um, yeah, it's fun. The Windrider is a really unique product. It's a, it's a trimaran, which um, multi-hull, obviously three hulls makes it a trimaran. And I had actually not seen a trimaran before. I had sailed a catamaran in the past. And when I saw one on a beach at a resort, I was totally intrigued. As you can see, it's a, kind of a unique design, kayak style seating versus the opposing seats in a regular monohull boat. And I, um, I, I met the previous owner actually at a reception and told him how much I loved the boat and I ended up buying the company as a result. Bruce took me out on a Windrider try because when we saw it, someone else going out on it, we said, hey, that looks pretty cool. And we got sailing on it and we just loved it. So then last day, Bruce told us about it for sailboat and right before we left and we got our dad to buy it and still have it. Before we found Windriders, I was done with sailing. I wasn't going to get on another sailboat ever. And I thought, you know what, this looks fun, it looks safe, it looks like adventure sailing. You know, I hate being in a fiberglass boat where you're, you know, bobbing around the middle of a lake, afraid to touch anything. And these boats are just, they're, they're wonderful. You just, you know, you don't have to worry about running ashore or hitting anything. You just bounce and go. Uh, not only is it simple to sail, but it's extremely safe. Um, great for resorts or at a cabin or lakefront where you would let anyone just go get in it and go. It takes no, t no uh, experience to learn. It's single-handed sailing. It's foot pedal steering. So you push right, go right. You push left, you go left. The safety is extraordinary because these, these boats, unlike beach catamarans, they don't flip over. They're designed, they get their initial stability from the design itself, which is very different from the beach cats. Uh, for instance, uh, Hobie Cat or G Cat or a Soul Cat. They all can tip over in a gust of wind. These wind riders are designed so that they don't do that. The best way to experience a wind rider is to try it yourself. So visit www.windrider.com and find a representative near you and become a member of the wind rider family. <laughs>